Hey, Jason from Bohemia Bees. Uh, we're going to do a little bit of harvesting of Ross combs here. So uh, I, don't, I only had one shallow super. This is a standard size super where typically frames go in harvesting honey. This is what they call a shallow super. It's a little shorter. And these are where the Ross comb uh, setup goes in. Um, you can see they're individual uh, type frames that have these insert discs that allow the bees to build out both sides the uh, honey okay uh, on both sides now what we're going to look for is we're going to look for the combs that are fully capped so the example you want you see on the end down here this is fully capped and if I look underneath it's fully capped on that side as well this side over here is actually fully capped on this side but it's not capped on this side so we're not going to harvest this one we're going to put that back in a in a colony to let them finish it off uh, but I wanted to get as many of the ones that were capped off for the spring harvest as I could uh, and then as we go out of this dearth for the summer and go into the fall, uh, they're going to finish them off. Uh, and they'll, so the ones that are actually not completely capped, they'll have to draw out and they'll put more of a, a fall nectar uh, in there, which will give it a different flavor. So we'll have some different variety. But I'm going to show you how we're going to do this today. Um, the way you remove a Ross comb is you actually have to take out, take apart the actual frame. So it just pulls apart as you can see and there's the one side um, if you notice inside the actual frame there's a very very thin piece of honeycomb or not honeycomb but foundation and that's wax foundation it's pure clean wax foundation it's edible just like any other wax that a bee would draw it out um, and again it's very very thin and allowed it to kind of create that base for them so if I look at this frame of and I look at what's on the back and on the front, I really don't have but maybe two fully capped Ross rounds. So I'm gonna take, I'm gonna pull that Ross round out, okay? Inspect it to make sure that it is capped to my satisfactory. Um, and then I'm gonna take a sharp knife and I'm going to trim off the edges. Being very careful not to damage the product up. Okay. All right, so now I have a trimmed up Ross comb, and I'm going to take and I'm going to get an opaque bottom. This is an opaque bottom. Okay, and I'm going to slide that Ross comb in that opaque bottom. And you can get these from Man Lake. Usually this whole setup you can get from Man Lake, and then you're going to put your clear cap on top. Okay, once the clear cap um, locks into place, there's actually these little grooves that will help it level it out. But you want to make sure they twist and they lock into place. And then make sure that your uh, top and your bottom are, are solid. We're going to then take these labels, okay, and we're going to wrap them around the uh, outside which is going to allow us to, to close it off completely. And so we've gotten so far approximately nine, and I'm going to inspect this one right here, probably 10, and I have another frame or two in here that has some on it. So I'm making about a dozen out of this one. Um, there are eight frames in Ross frames, Ross comb frames in this shallow super. Uh, and for my first time trying it, I think the bees did a pretty uh, darn good job of filling them out. So uh, we're going to just continue on and uh, show how we are boxing up the rest of these and uh, we'll put this other shallow super uh, with some new uh, foundation put in those other areas to help them finish it out. Thanks for watching. If you like what you see, make sure you like the video, comment below if you have any questions, uh, and then share with your friends so we can continue to grow our Bohemia Bee audience. Subscribe to the channel so you can check out when we have new, uh, new videos. Um, appreciate you watching. Thanks.